Today we've got an epic showdown. We have in the left corner here, we have the December 2019 Bam Box Pop Culture Edition going up head to head against the Loot Crate basic subscription box, a pop culture box. This one is from way back in June 2019. That took six months to get to me because of the bankruptcy that Loot Crate had to deal with. So just got in this box. So I decided, you know, it's time to just, let's let's go head to head. Bam box pop culture. Loot crate pop culture. Who wins? Who is victorious? We will start with the challenger. Since I think Loot Crate has been around longer than Bambox, we'll just call him like, you know, the champion since longevity. So we'll go with the challenger first, the Bambox. This box is available, I think for around 30 bucks or so every month. I don't even know. I just have the subscription and they just charge me every single month. I think it's around 30 bucks. This always includes like an autograph, an art print, a monthly pin, usually like something else thrown in. So let's see what is in this one, and then Loot Crate will fire right back with its contents. Black paper to start with. Comes out strong, comes out swinging black paper to take on the black box. And here we go. First item the squishy toy okay so bam box comes out with a little like a squishy toy that you'd give to like your pet to chew up like a stress ball relief so i pulled out the main item first this toy t-rex has been hand signed by aaron laplante never heard of him who voices spear in jenny Tarta Cosby's Primal? Never heard of it. It was signed during a private signing for the BAM Pop Culture Box. It's guaranteed to be authentic. So there's a gentleman who signed it. I do, don't know who he is. I don't even know what the TV show is. I don't know if it's a cartoon or a live action or anime or what. But he signed the front of the chest. He signed it Aaron. So... I'm not keeping this. I'm, I'm, I'm going to sell this thing. I have no idea who this guy even is or the TV show. So that's the first item from the BAM box. Eh, that's the main item too, and I'm just not too impressed with it. Honestly, not too impressed. So here we go, monthly pin in the BAM box. We have, hello nurse. Oh, what's that TV show called, that cartoon? I don't know, I'm going to blank. But that, yeah, that just, that little T-Rex, little squishy dog kind of uh, soured the mood of this video pretty quickly. That's kind of a huge letdown. That's your main hit in this entire box, and it's just like a little dog chew toy. Here we go, next item. We have like a pillowcase or something, or a banner, or what is it? Okay, I'm seeing the back of it. Or maybe, oh. <laughs> You're seeing the back, I'm seeing the front of it. So we have a Cobra Kai banner. This actually is pretty cool right here. Strike first, strike hard, no mercy. Okay, that's, that's pretty awesome. I gotta give it to Bandbox right there. This Cobra Kai flag, it's actually kind of awesome. I like it. That's cool. And then we have art print left. The art print is, I'll show you first as always, I forgot. Looks like Kylo Ren and Rey fighting scene done like uh, anime kind of a style. Decent looking print, autographed by the artist. So here's the cheat sheet for this, of the possible variations. There's actually a variant to that picture. Looks like I don't have the variant. So that's it. That was this month's box. Um, yeah, not a huge fan of this band box. Like this thing was just a huge letdown. 
If it wasn't for this Cobra Kai flag, this box would get two thumbs down. But the Cobra Kai flag helped it only get one thumb down. So, not my favorite band box. Most of the stuff in this, except for the flag. Mm. So, Loot Crate might actually crush the band box. Maybe. Here we go. June 2019, Loot Crate. This looks very familiar. It is, I think they actually recycled this, this this box again, but here we go. Start with the t-shirt. And this box looks very familiar, or at least the contents. Yeah, this is all recycled stuff, I think. They just recycled stuff from past boxes. Let's do this t-shirt first. Got an all black t-shirt, which I like. I like my black t-shirts. It's actually a very heavy shirt. Well, that's a very busy looking shirt. What is that? Technodrome. Oh, well, the tag says Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Loot Wear Exclusive. So, yeah, this isn't even a, a loot. This is actually meant for loot rare. Loot wear. This is a turtle shirt. I've never really followed, watched much of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So I don't even know what the shirt e even even is. Um, I like it because it's a black t-shirt. Pretty decent quality shirt, but I have no clue with this graphic. I don't see any turtles in this graphic. I guess these must be the villains. But like I said, I don't. I'm I'm not a turtles fan. Never have been my entire life. It came out originally back when I was a child. And yeah, I don't really know much about the turtles, but yeah, I mean, decent shirt, I guess. So next item, we have an egg. We've got a Zelda egg. Must be like one of those LOL kind of egg with the, with like the, the surprise inside, but instead it's made for Zelda Four Swords Adventures. I actually have a future family member who's actually a big fan of Zelda. So I actually will keep this thing sealed and just give it to that individual and uh, just let them have it like nice and sealed. So I won't open this thing up. I'm sure it's probably just a mini figure of somebody who's in the Zelda video game. Okay. So far this box has not wowed me. Okay, I also have this from a past Loot Crate box also. We have a Terminator 2 a brain chip keychain. Yeah, this is from the Chronicle box, I think. It was made back in... There's no date on it, but yeah. I have got this before in a past box. Maybe a Loot Crate DX box or something. But I mean, it's kind of cool. I mean, it's the brain chip from the, uh, from the Terminator. Okay, but I mean, it is recycled. It is not exclusive to this box. But, I mean, could be worse. So, so far, actually, the Cobra Kai flag from the band box has won so far. Next item, let's just do this monthly pin. We've got a Change Mutant Ninja Turtles. Looks like we got Raphael as a little baby Raphael. This is 2019. Okay. That's okay. <sighs> this thing again i have got this thing three times in loot crate boxes now i'm actually just gonna keep this thing sealed because you've seen this on my channel two times before the dungeons and dragons at castle dice tower it's a little figurine of a little, of a little dragon that holds your playing dice on the back of it so this is a third time i've gotten this exact same item in a loot crate box Wow, so I think this entire box, I think it's just recycled stuff. The whole box is. So, June 2019, Loot Crate Box. The exclusive Dungeons and Dragons, Castle Dice Tower, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Seen it before. Then, exclusive Team Moon Turtle Technodrome t-shirt. Before you start yelling, Calabunga, I'm fighting the Foot Clan. Sit down with a slice of pizza and this exclusive. Da, 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 gives you the blueprint from Dimension X. No clue what that is. Shirt colors, like turtles, may vary. Oh, so I luckily actually got a black, because I actually am going to wear this like to like the gym and stuff. Yes, I do go to the gym. doesn't look like it, but I do. 
Looks like the one on here is like a purplish bluish t-shirt, so I'm actually happy I got a black one out so I can actually can wear it. Then a Legend of Zelda figure. Looks like everybody actually got the same one. And then a delightful surprise in your toy box. Half of the fun of our childhood toy boxes were rediscovering old favorites. This month's crate includes a surprise looter favorite item, which is the Terminator brain chip. So, yeah, they, they even say, you know, yeah. Then a turtle's pen. So, between the band box and the loot crate box, who is the winner? Well, the band box had the coolest item in it with the Cobra Kai flag. This was the winner in terms of item, but both boxes, honestly, in my opinion, were very weak. Um, actually, I'd say in terms of value, the Loot Crate box has more value in it, and it's actually cheaper than the Band Box by just a few dollars. But the Band Box did have an autograph in it, and the best item was in the Band Box. But in terms of value, I mean, if you actually wanted to sell this stuff, you could probably resell the Loot Crate stuff for more money than what you could the band box stuff so i'm just going to going by a reselling perspective that i could get more for the loot crate stuff to resell which actually everything here i will sell i'll just keep the flag or in the t-shirt so that's what we got so in this one i gotta say in terms of cool factor band box had the coolest item so they won in terms of cool factor band box won in terms of value loot crate won so you make your decision of who you want to buy from I buy from both, and they have up months and down months. So, hope you enjoyed this video of this versus series of the Bambox versus Loot Crate. Who wins in your opinion? I'll see you next time. <laughs>